So, should you make that move to a new city? Should you marry the person you're dating? Are you in the right career? How can you know that you're headed in the right direction? Well, let's talk about dreams that reveal you're in the will of God. When it comes to knowing God's will, some things are clearly defined in the Bible, like staying clear of sexual immorality, loving God above everyone else, and treating others as you would like to be treated. But knowing whether you should take a certain job or go back to school is not always quite that simple. Sometimes it's hard to know the will of God. So in this video, we're going to look at dreams that reveal you're in the will of God. Number one, you're walking down the middle of a road. So you can have a dream where you're walking right down the center line of a road or street. The sun may be shining and you have a specific destination in mind. You may feel as if you're headed in the right direction. This type of dream could represent that you are in the center of God's will. Now, being in the middle of the road in a dream can also be a play on words, meaning not having a particular opinion or being neutral on a certain subject. But depending on what's happening in the dream, usually if you are in the middle of a road or if you're in the center of a room or in the middle of a building and you're very aware that you are in the center of a space, this could represent that you're in the center of God's will. Now, this type of dream can also represent the favor of God. Ezekiel 5.5 says, This is what the Lord God says. This is Jerusalem. I have placed her at the center of the nations with lands around her. Now you can also have a dream where you're walking into a recreation center or a cultural center. And because the word center is a part of the dream, this too could be speaking of being in the center of God's will. So if you dream that you're walking down the middle of a street, this could be showing that you're in the center of God's will or you're walking in the favor of God. Number two, you're headed downtown. Now a downtown area is the central area or the main business and commercial area of a town or a city. So if in your dream you are aware that you're headed downtown, this would mean that you're headed towards the center of God's will for your life. You haven't arrived yet, but you're headed in the right direction on the way to fulfilling your God-ordained purpose. Proverbs 3, 6 says, In all your ways submit to him, and he will make your path straight. Now you can have a dream that you're headed downtown either on foot or on public transportation, and there is a difference between the two. If you're walking towards downtown, this would be showing that it will take effort to fulfill the will of God. Someone once had a dream that they were headed downtown on foot. In fact, they were barefoot and they were walking on rocks and rough terrain and the journey was long and painful, but they made it to the downtown destination. But if you're riding to downtown on a bus or a train, for instance, this would be implying that the path would be easier and not as difficult as walking. Keep in mind that a train or a bus can also represent a church or a ministry organization, and this ministry would help you to fulfill your purpose in God. So whether you're headed downtown on foot or by way of public transportation, this would be showing that you're headed in the right direction towards the will of God for your life. You can also have a dream where you're hitchhiking to the downtown area or to a specific destination. Hitchhiking in a dream can mean that you depend on others to advance or move you forward in life. In this type of scenario, God could be encouraging you to focus on Him and trust that He will lead and guide you in the path that you should go. 
Number three, you're in the town square. So you can have a dream where you're sitting or standing in the town square. Now the town square in a town would be considered to be the heart of the town where people gather for special happenings or important events. So if you dream you're standing in or sitting in the town square, this may be showing that you're right where God wants you to be and you're in the center of his will. Jesus said in Mark 3.35, For whoever does the will of God, he is my brother and sister and mother. So if you have a dream that you're in the town square, this would be showing that you're in the will of God for your life. Number five, you're in the living room. So the living room in a house is the place where people come together and fellowship. And it's also considered to be the center of a house. So if you have a dream that you're in your living room, perhaps you're praying or you're reading the Bible or you're in fellowship with God, this could represent that you are in the center of God's will. In John 14, 23, Jesus said, If anyone loves me, he will keep my word, and my Father will love him, and we will come to him and make our abode with him. So if you have this type of dream, God could either be encouraging you to draw closer to him and have fellowship with him, or he could be showing that you are in the center of the will of God. Hey, have you picked up your copy of The Mysterious Language of Dreams yet? In this book, I go more in depth about dreams and dream interpretation than I do on my YouTube videos. I talk about the depth dimension of dreams, dream layers. I talk about the time dimension of a dream. Also, dreams and the imagination, which is quite interesting. I also have put over 40 real life, actual dreams that people have dreamt in the book for you to practice your interpretation skills. Also in the back of the book is a dream dictionary with over 400 dream symbols. So I've left a link in the description box below where you can go and pick up your copy of the mysterious language of dreams today. Have you had any of these types of dreams? And also, do you believe that you are in the will of God for your life right now? I want to hear your thoughts on that. Leave them in the comment section. And if you're not a part of the Dream Team, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn on your notification bell so that you won't miss any upcoming videos. And give me a thumbs up if you like this video. I'll talk to you all next time.